Hello and welcome back to Pharmacomania. I'm Dr. Shanaz Malik and here with uh, introduction of the pharmacology. So what is pharmacology? So pharmacology is the science that deals with the effect of the drug on living organism or living system. So now what is drug? According to WHO, World Health Organization defined drug as any substance or product that is used or intended to be used to modify or to explore physiological system or pathological state of the benefit of recipient. It is the substance or product that is for use or intended to be used to modify or explore physiological system or pathological state for the benefit of recipient. Now, what is pharmacokinetic? Pharmacokinetic is the uh, movement of the drug within the body. It includes process of absorption, distribution, metabolism, and excretion of the drug. It means what the body does to the drug. It is the movement of the drug and part of the pharmacokinetic are absorption, distribution, metabolism, and excretion of the now let's say about the various category of the drug first is the over-the-counter drug which are sold on the uh, counter of the medical store Th these drugs are uh, like uh, paracetamol or antacid which doesn't require any kind of the doctor's prescription other is the prescription drug which required registered medical practitioners prescription and these drugs are antibiotic and antipsychotic drugs now Drug nomenclature. What is drug nomenclature? Any drug having three kind of the name. First is the chemical name, non-proprietary name or the generic name and third one is the proprietary name or brand name. So first is the chemical. It denotes the chemical structure of the drug like acetyl salicylic acid is the chemical name of the aspirin and, and acetyl, cysteine, acetyl P aminophenol is the paracetamol. It is not suitable for use in the prescription. Now, non-proprietary name. What is non-proprietary name? So, it is assigned by competent scientific body or authority, the United States Adapted Name, USAN Council. And WHO along with its member council select the and recommended the international non-proprietary name or INN for a drug. And it is uniform throughout the world and denote the active pharmaceutical ingredient. So international non-proprietary name is commonly used as a generic name and generic name should be used in prescription because they are more economical and generally uniform all over the world and their, uh, then their count, branded counterpart name. Now, proprietary name or brand name, it is given by drug manufacturer and brand name are short and easy to recall and drugs sold under brand name are expensive as compared to their generic, uh, generic version of the drug. The drug usually has many brand name. It may have different name within country as well as different country. Now, chemical name of aspirin is acetyl salicylic acid and aspirin is generic name and ecosprin or Dispirin are brand name or proprietary name and n acetyl p aminophenol is the chemical name of the paracetamol and paracetamol is a generic name and crocin and metacin are the brand name of the paracetamol. Now what is pharmacodynamic? It is study of drug uh, mechanism of action, pharmacological action and their adverse effect. It cover all aspects related to what the drug does to the body what the drug does to the body. Now, what is pharmacy? It is also science of uh, uh, that deal with uh, preparation, preservation, standardization, compounding, dispensing, and proper utilization of drugs. So, pharmacy is the science of the preparing, preserving, standardization, com compounding, dispensing, and proper utilization of the drug. Now, what is therapeutics? Therapeutics is the aspect of medicine concerned with the treatment of the disease. And what is chemotherapy? 
it deal with the treatment of infectious disease or cancer with chemical compound that causes relative selective damage to the infecting organism or cancer cell now what is toxicity it is the study of poison their action detection prevention and treatment of poisoning and uh, clinical pharmacology is the systemic study of the drug in human being both in healthy healthy volunteer as well as patients it include the evaluation of pharmacokinetic and pharmacodynamic data safety efficacy and adverse effect of the drug by comparing if comparing clinical trials what is essential medicine according to who essential medicine are those that satisfy the health care uh, need of the majority of the population they should be assured quality availability at all time in adequate quantity and in appropriate dosage form they should be selected about disease prevalence in the country evidence on safety and efficacy and comparative cost effectiveness now example of the essential medicine are iron and folic acid preparation for the anemia of in the pregnancy so iron and folic acid should be available all the time should it should be available in adequate quantity appropriate dosage form and uh, it should be available all the time now anti tubercular drug uh, like isoniazid rifampicin pyrazinamide and ethambutal it's also um, included in essential drug list now orphan drug uh, these are the drug for the use for the diagnosis treatment and prevention of the rare diseases and the expenses of this uh, drug development manufacture and marketing is not cannot be recovered by the pharmaceutical company for from the selling of the drug examples are digoxin antibodies for digoxin toxicity and pomepizole used in the methyl alcohol poisoning so uh, this drug are the orphan drug and they are not easily access in the market now sources of drug information pharmacopia is the book that contain list of the established or officially approved uh, drug and uh, description of this uh, the physical and chemical characteristic and taste for their identification purification and method of storage so uh, example are indian pharmacopia british pharmacopia european pharmacopia and united state pharmacopia so another uh, source of drug information is the formulary it provide information about available drug in the country their use dosage formulation adverse drug reaction contraindication indication precaution warning and guidance and on selecting the right drug for the range of condition and other sources of information are uh, like national formularies martin dell physician desk reference etc uh now sources of drugs they are uh, natural semi synthetic and synthetic natural sources are plant animal mineral and microorganism and semi synthetic drug are obtained from the natural sources and later on chemically modified and synthetic drug are produced artificially source of the drug natural source from the plant so alkaloids are nitrogen containing compound example are morphine atropine quinine rezepine and ephedrine are alkaloid glycoside containing a sugar group in combination with non sugar through interlink with ether linkage and uh, example are digoxin and digitoxin now uh, next is the volatile oil have aroma like um, uh, eucalyptus oil uh, clove oil and uh, flavoring agent like peppermint oil and resin a sticky organic uh, compound obtained from the exudate it is uh, tincture benzoin benzoin now insulin heparin and antisera are from the animal source uh, ferrous sulfate magnesium sulfate are available in the mineral and penicillin g streptomycin griseofulvin are source of the microorganism semi synthetic are uh, hydromorphine and hydrocodone 
synthetic compound most of the drug used today are synthetic like aspirin and paracetamol drug are also produced by genetic engineering like dna recombinant technique examples are human insulin uh, human growth hormone and um, vaccines thank you for watching the video